Phony again. Phony again. You know the nicest thing about this party? Uh, the bounce house or the petting zoo? Seeing your gruff, grumpy brother doting on Violet, making this day special for her. I mean, can you think of any other circumstance where Dr. Hamilton Finn would get on a pony ride? No, no. It's amazing how kids can change your life. Okay, let's just say it's a given that Willow would never leave me because she would feel terrible and she's just not that kind of person. No, she's not. But honestly, how could she ever be happy? And I'm talking about the rest of her life if Nell gets custody of Wiley and Willow knows that she could have stopped it, but then didn't. Hey, I could use a walk. How about you? Maybe we shouldn't have gone to that party. Are you kidding? We were not going to miss Violet's birthday extravaganza. Thanks, but I see what it does to you. It's not the party, it's just the day. I'm fine. You should go back. What, and leave you alone? I can handle a walk through the park by myself. I'm resourceful that way. Okay, you are the most resourceful and resilient person that I have ever met. But I know how it weighs on you, worrying about Wiley and what will happen if Janelle gets custody. It's one thing for Nell to balk about elective preventative surgery, but... What if Wiley's condition gets worse and she still refuses? Then Michael and his lawyers will handle it. What if it's it? not enough? I'm sorry, I know it's not my problem to solve, but... Hey, you have been more of a mother to Wiley than Janelle Benson ever could. But I'm not his mother. Okay. No, no, it's not. Wiley isn't even a person to know. He's... A means to an end. A weapon she can use against Michael and his family. Hey, you're preaching to the choir. Hey, you know Nell better than most people. Do you think if the worst happens and Nell gets custody, she'll be able to look past her own selfish needs and act in Wiley's best interest? Because I sure as hell don't. I'm definitely gonna have to change his name. Jonah seems a bit morbid now, but I really like the name William. I I'm sorry, what? Plus, William is much classier than... Wiley. But Wiley is the name he knows. Yeah, he'll adjust. Wiley is a person. You can't just take away his name now. Oh my god, I am so sick of you and your self-righteousness. I will raise him however the hell I please. He's my son. So despite what you think and all of your delusions, please just remember that your son is dead and stay the hell away from mine. <sighs> I'm sorry. I, I keep going on about this. Between me and Michael, it's probably all you ever hear about. There is a simple solution. It's not easy, not by a long shot, but there is a way to fight Janelle and improve Michael's chances of getting full custody. You marry him. First suggested it, you said it was crazy. Yeah. As in flat out insane. But I've had time to think about it, to watch you just agonize over Wiley, and I've, I've realized that it's, it's not my decision to make, it's yours. So if you wanna stay in Wiley's life and help Michael get custody, then, then you gotta marry him. But if you decide not to, you need to take a step back and let Wiley's situation be Michael's problem, not yours. Honestly, 